The countdown is on. Only a few days to go until Interpack. Before that, once again, the latest news and background from the world of packaging. Today, where does automation help with packaging? It's all about artificial intelligence for cosmetics packaging, green packaging for everything that is temperature sensitive, and we show you flexible packaging in the pharmaceutical sector. Fashionable topic or perennial favorite, the whole world is talking about automation. Especially in times of labor shortages, many companies are now looking for suitable solutions. Of course, packaging can be automated around the clock. In the best case, faster, more careful, and safer. However, there are a few things to keep in mind. At the beginning, there should be a cost-benefit analysis. Robotic specialist Omron, for example, offers a return on investment calculator. Then there is the question of which process should actually be automated. The loading and unloading of machines and depalletizing in particular lend themselves to this. Syntagon is also showing solutions at Interpack. The BEC side-loading cartoner packs cake pieces in up to 135 boxes per minute. Product inspection is also suitable for automation. For example, the new detector from Mettler Toledo detects metallic foreign bodies in dry food products, but also in meat boxes and flour sacks. Let's summarize. The automation of work steps shines with numerous advantages, but also represents a weighty investment, especially for small businesses and SMEs. That's why it's good to get informed beforehand. At Interpack, digital technologies are particularly in focus as a hot topic. How do you preserve the irresistible aroma of coffee? What ensures that personal care products and cosmetics stay effective for a long time? Can hygiene product packaging protect both the product and our environment for the future? Questions like these have been driving Optima for more than 100 years. Together with customers, Optima ensures the reliability and protection of challenging product packaging and ensures they reach the people who depend on them each day. Optima is a technology leader in filling, dosing, and packaging both liquid and solid products. Their solutions make valuable contributions to better health, safety, and quality of life. Optima says, we care for our customers and we care for innovations. Thinking about tomorrow, today. This means creating exceptionally sustainable solutions in harmony with community and nature. Helping people around the world to enjoy a healthy, safe, and bright future. Optima, we care for people. Control that is getting better and better. That, in a nutshell, is the idea behind an inspection system based on artificial intelligence, now presented by SEA Vision. The new lipstick control solution is still under development, but it already shows some of the possibilities that are likely to be pushed further in the coming years. And lipsticks have not been chosen for nothing. They are particularly susceptible to product defects and deformation. In addition, blemishes may appear on the surface or the color may be uneven. Such defects are to be detected with SEA Vision's new AI-based inspection system for lipsticks, pixel by pixel. The algorithm is constantly learning itself and can thus identify increasingly complex faults. When groceries are shipped, or other products that are temperature sensitive, styrofoam is usually used. A startup from Munich wants to change that and is betting on a sustainable alternative that provides cooling and protection with recycled materials. The material for thermal insulation was developed together with scientists from the Technical University of Dresden. The result is an ecological shipping insulation made of cellulose fibers. Its name? Paper flock. Cellulose fibers are particularly suitable because they offer very low thermal conductivity compared to other ecological insulation materials. The range includes insulated bags and boxes, the Easy Akkus, and for festivals where drinks need to stay cool even in summer without electricity, the Festival Cooler. By the way, the paper flock inventors are one of several young companies presenting themselves at Interpack in the startup zone.
This is the Stick Pack, a trendsetter at the moment in the field of pharmaceutical packaging. They too must keep their finger on the pulse, and because pre portioned medicines are becoming more and more important, flexible packaging such as the Stick Pack offers many advantages. But how do you package such sticks? For example, with this machine from the Spanish company Volpac. It is designed for the production and processing of single serving stick packs and achieves a capacity of up to 1,800 units per minute. According to the company, 42% less packaging material is used than with comparable machines. And because it requires only little floor space, it can also be used in smaller rooms. And this is just one of countless innovative packaging machines on show at Interpack. The clock is ticking. It starts on May 4th. We look forward to seeing you again at the Interpack in Dusseldorf, perhaps also in our Glass TV studio. Seven days of Mesa TV Live.